Let's push through the center here and see what we have. Let's block the pawn. Let's take. Oh, they're coming with this funky stuff. Uh, let's bring the bishop here. Looks like they're still going to do it. Oh, they're not doing it. What I don't want is this queen coming here and coming here. I think we'll just push the pawn. Take. See if we'll get castled. No, they're not allowing us to get castled. Still not allowing. Let's take castle. Lose pawn. Probably going to double some more. Maybe not. Let's try and resist that one. Okay, shall we attack the rook? Bait in the pawn. Pawn comes down. Hmm. Maybe come here. They're just going for total destruction, aren't they? Let's just attack the rock. Total destruction. Yeah, we were thinking of pushing this, and if they forget themselves, we can take the knight. It's supporting and the pawn's going to be blocking the center here. We're still managing this open file as best we can. Oh, do we take simple direct moves to remove pieces from the board strategically? I don't think it harms us taking it. Let's take. And we could take, take, and it's bishops of opposite colour, and we've got double pawns, which is the extra pawn, so it's probably a draw. Let's take, and attack. Just take. They're pushing down forcefully to make some space here. Just bring the bishop defending. Do not believe they will take. Yep. I think it's time for the king to move. Bishop's going here. Don't want it to go there, but that's where it's going. Stopping us from doing this. Not doing that. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. If we hit it, it can push down, take takes. Oh, he's leaving it. The bishop comes here, it's on the king. King moves up. Alright. Or maybe the pawn takes. I think the pawn's just taking, isn't it? Damn it. Yeah, the pawn's just going to take. What do we do? What do we do? Maybe we're panicking over nothing. Hit this side.
Where's he going? If he takes that, we can take this. His pawn drops here. Doesn't really give us much, does it? We push up. A check on the king. Obviously, you take the pawn. But we're not going to do that. It's getting locked down. I don't think there's any moves we can make. Apart from he's not coming back here because this pawn's here for now. We are on dark squares. If the king starts moving across to do something, but coming here takes, takes. Bishop's there. Must be delicate operation time. Bishop can come here to do something. Or it could come here to go here. All his pawns were on white squares. If we took, he takes. Oh, if we move, he goes here. If we move there, he goes there. He's got a two on one then, so we have to take. So do we just take anyway? I'm going to take. Yeah, now we can move, but then his bishop comes and defends the pawn as we're trying to get up around the back. His king comes across. No dice. Unless the bishop moves here and just blocks that off. I'm just moving here. Strange as it may seem, we're still plus one, but we're never getting that pawn in there. He can just come here like this. There's nothing else, is there? Bishop can come here, but <clears throat> issue we've got is their king is just going to slowly come down, 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 and it'll be able to attack the bishop. So we may as well just leave it here. Do we run out of moves? Probably not. Let's go here. Let's attack the bishop. Jumps there. And we can leave the bishop like that. And is there any method of trying to make this stronger? Not really, because the bishop just comes here and blocks it off. Let's go. Yeah, he's going there, see? Let's go here. And it's just blocking it all off. Don't think there's any other genius ideas, is there? Apart right from trying to get the king all the way across here, in their pawn. The only tiny thing, I think. Let's try that. His king's going to be fast enough, I think. Yep. And then the bishop's got something, so we can hit the pawn. The problem is, before we go running there, if we hit the pawn and say they do take and then we go here like this the bishop comes here puts a check on the king and then the king is checkmated by a bishop because it can't go here it can't go there and it can't come back so well, that's a bit crazy there's no point in doing that move let's just move to the side but to talk it through Let's attack it. There's not. Okay, we'll take a repet. Nice one. Right, go on to the next game. See what happens in this one. 10 0. Yeah, playing as black. I think I sorted my settings out. I was a bit confused as to what was 
going on, seeing as it's my second stream on this YouTube thing. And let's just push here. Develop the night. Small piece attacking the higher piece. Let's attack the queen and let's just support the knight. Probably taking. Let's take with the bishop. Got a two on one here. He's got no other piece, but we can't take because he's on our queen. Looks like they've got a little bit of smarts this player. Let's go here. We can now take the pawn. It's just that we're going to have pressure on our king. I think we'll castle. We probably maybe could have done it. We'll have a look at the analysis. No, they've got a bit of smarts. Now they're protecting. Hmm. A little bit clever, aren't we, fella? Let's attack the bishop. With the bishop. Let's take... Get ready to move the knight. Take with the bishop. Queen's on the pawn. Oh, it's not taking with the pawn. It's on the knight. Let's just bring the knight here. Too clever, this player, really. A little bit swish. A little bit swish. Let's go here. A little bit quick, aren't they? Let's attack the rook. Oh, my dear. Let's go with that. Brings the pawn in. Bring the rook here. Maybe looking to disturb. Queen's coming for the pawn. Not come for the pawn yet. It's gone supporting the pawn. I don't know why, but should we be protecting this pawn? Greedy munching queen? Or do we attack the queen? Attack the queen. He's got protection. Does on pass on. We take knight. Knight takes. What's happening with this pawn here? Let's run through that again. Attack. Maybe they do on pass on, or maybe they just move the queen out of the way. Okay, so they do on pass on. We're not getting the queen because this pawn is in the way. That's why. That was what was making my brain go funny. I was thinking, but how do I get the queen? There, does on pass on. Do we just bring this pawn in? Or do we take with the queen? Is there anything else? Space there though, isn't there? Alright, so there, if they on pass on, queen takes. They can go greedy munching for the pawn, which I'm probably expecting them to do. It doesn't want to get hit by the rook. It goes greedy munching for the pawn. We're taking too long. I think they're starting to flicker. If we did come with the rook, it comes down for the pawn. No, nothing. Knight goes down for the pawn. Knight. No, nothing. I think we're just going to push the pawn up. Well, they're going for it anyway. Let's just take this pawn. Got two pieces odd here now. So are we falling for a trick or is he going to get the pawn? He's getting the pawn. Knight can take, but then the rook can come and x-ray through to the queen. It's going to be a pawn for a pawn type thing. Okay, let's do with that. He does take, so we can attack the queen or is there anything better? Maybe attack the queen, but he's going to take the pawn. Hmm. I am. Oh, I wanted to go and get his rook, but I can't do that. Can't do that because the knight is there. If we took the pawn and his rook takes, then we come here, but then he can come back because the knight is supporting. And the knight is supporting this square. Hmm. Maybe just push the pawn up. No, because it gets taken. Push, it gets taken. Oof. 
It looks tricky. We were plus one. Now we're now equal. Something's telling me there's better things we can do. Got a two on one on this pawn. Whilst he's greedy munching the pawn. Maybe not that. Can't do this. No, because he's just going to back rank us in. Well, it was from the back with the queen. What else is there? Let me see. What is the better move? They're a little bit swish, these, this player. Not really liking their style. Knight. It's at the minute the queen is protecting both. If the knight comes here, then maybe... Does he have an attack? No. Knight. What am I planning with the knight? Any attacks towards here? It is a knight move. I know it's a knight move. What about this? Let's go with the knight move. And if they forget themselves and take one of the pawns, we take the queen. Let's not forget. Yes, I don't like this player's playing style. Now he's, he's going for the trade, splitting his pawns. It's at a moment of impatience. So we take, pawn takes, take, pawn takes. Now he's going to be protecting the pawn with the rook. Now it's really guarding these beautiful squares, really, isn't it? Oh, it's moved. Has he got my king? Is he looking for this thing, tucking here? What's the knight got? Knight's got like um, 2 on 1, but the rook comes and defends, which is annoying. Yeah, so the rook can come here to defend. It's got no protection on it, so we could push onto the pawn, but he can push. Hmm. Not actually doing that, but what he's thinking is, we go here, then his rook comes here. Our rook doesn't have any defense on. Our knight can come here to defend the knight. The rook, sorry. So we'll take, we're attacking his knight, but we're thinking he's going to come here. Oh, he's not doing that. So luckily that pawn is in front. I think we can come down and defend now. So we're plus one again. I don't think we can defend it though, because we come here, he's just going to come and attack this pawn. So why don't we just attack the rook and just double the pawns? Because we can't. Ooh, let's take. Push. And get the king across. King up. King up. King up. We've got three minutes. That's not really a passer, so I don't need to lose any sleep. If we do push this, it kind of locks ourselves. I'm actually going to hit the palm. Maybe thinking of pushing past. So now we have a passer, so he has something to think about. Let's go here. He has to babysit that palm forever now. So I'll just bring the king across. Once he moves, we can go on and he goes and it looks like they may have left the game very tense oh well claim victory i'm still staring at the screen oh dear all right, so that's the that's the session on searching for better moves in a way. And I think we'll play one more and then we'll we'll call it a day. We'll call it a session. All right, playing as black. Okay, let's push through the center and block, and let's develop the knight. Let's bring the bishop out. 
trying to prevent the fried liver, but they may be brave and just go for it anyway, in a reverse order. I'm going to take, just push the pawn. Take. Looking for a mass attack on the king, doesn't want us to get castled. Let's just get castled. Take. Three pawn if they forget themselves. Also the rook. Nah, they know the system. Let's just bring the bishop here, see if we get a discovery on the queen. But it doesn't look like they're falling asleep anytime soon. So what do we have? Bishop can come here. Only piece that can touch it is this pawn. Let's block this pawn so that this pawn's not opening up the bishop. Which means the queen's going to move so that this pawn can hit the bishop. I'll bring the queen here, see if we can disturb the queen. Stop the actions of this type of attack situation coming on. And also the sneaky little rook coming around the back. I'm going to hit the queen with that plan and idea. That's the only spot, and we don't have, unluckily, we could hit here. It takes, and the bishop gets taken. Anything else? Just go opposite the queen, or shall we hit this pawn? Pawn takes, bishop takes. That might be your interesting, oh, but it does open up the bishop being able to attack the king. Am I going to have to do a slow move? And at which point this pawn's just going to hit the um, bishop. Yeah, so if we, even if we did do that, it could just hit the bishop, we're moving back. It says again. Mm-hmm. I still like it though, it's just that this, I don't like it when they win a bit of tempo. I don't think they're going to do that, so I'm going to push the pawn. If they do, we just move the king. I think they'll be more interested in getting rid of this bishop. And let's think about it. Yeah, I didn't think that we're going to do the bishop thing. It is available for them. So attacking our bishop doesn't like our bishop at all. So a smaller piece attacking a higher piece can't be wrong. It's just that if we do do that, he can take the bishop and it's on our queen. If we did push, he does do that. We can take his uh, knight off the board. It's an even exchange then. Yep, let's do that. Smaller piece attacking. I think he's going to be tunnel visioned. Oh, he's not tunnel visioned. So we do have a moment where we can actually move the bishop out of the way if we wanted to. But in essence, it's kind of a bad bishop because it's, you know, dark squares and everything. But we could save it. But if we save it, are we losing tempo? Because we're going to be blocking the rook. This pawn's defended by this pawn. That's okay. Don't really like the look of the position going moving. I prefer to just do that and this pawn supporting that pawn and this bishop is basically under attack so they will come and defend it with the rook. Yeah I think we're keeping that there so can we do anything proactive in terms of anything else what about this pawn what's this pawn looking to do push up and then it just pushes down, but it's a highly elevated pawn, which could cause them problems if the queen got into here somehow. I'm going to push the pawn. Their motor set to take, so we'll... Oh, they haven't done. So we'll go for the rook because it's kind of trapped in there, isn't it? Which should allow us... It should allow us... Getting rid of that and the queen coming here, shouldn't it? To try and sit in this square. Oh no, the queen will take. Or the bishop will take. And the annoying bishop puts a check on the king. 
Yeah, sorry, the bishop will take. Okay, it's on our queen. I think we wanted to try and keep this area, didn't we? If we could. So they're doing everything to the scratching like anything here. Six minutes. I wasn't even looking at the time. It's all about this white square bishop because when we take the bishop's going to take so it just just to stop us from going here the queen could take as well to stop us from going here to get to here i'm not sure what that is because it's giving up the rook isn't it did we highlight that it's giving up the rook am i falling for a set play type of situation I don't know. I'm not seeing it personally, but if there's a ch ch checkmate, then I'll be very surprised. So it's going for the exchange with the queen, so that saves the rook, which is a bit annoying, isn't it? So he's all doing all that to save the rook. But we do have an extra rook. It makes it a bit harder for us, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Is there anything better? Bishop takes the rook. No, because we don't have any protection for the queen. Let's go for the exchange. Getting too arty. And let's see if we can go for an exchange with the rook. You wouldn't expect them to, but... And own the open file as best possible. We get trapped in here with the rook. Go here and see if we can double. Let's come for the bishop. Okay, so he's trading down pieces. Do we need to rush doubling? Do we take or we want to keep ownership of the file if we can really? Okay, take him, could put a check on the king, he just bounces backwards and forwards, so he may as well take this pawn off I think, and see if we can get on the back rank. I do think the rook is probably looking to exchange now then, they might be getting a bit fed up. Yes, they are doing, so we could just take that off the board, or is there any other... No, I think we can take and just take some pawns off. Take this one off because this pawn's highly elevated. We may as well take this off here. King needs to move here to stop this from coming here. Yep. Let's come for this pawn. This one. And start pushing. Just keeping the king on the back. I don't think there's any rush for us to do anything else. So that's the end to the searching for better moves session. That was quite an interesting session for today. And second live stream on YouTube. Just trying to get the hang of the settings and stuff. I think we're not doing too bad so far. Looks like they're just going to let the time run out.
Oh, it's a good job it was the last one. So they waited that length of time thinking that we will have left the game. So strange. Strange behaviour. And obviously they're playing in another another tab, aren't they? They've started another game. Somewhere else in the internet world. Okay, thanks for that. Uh, was I looking at the analysis on this one for some reason? Because I didn't like <clears throat> didn't like this player's playing style at the beginning. I think this is the game, isn't it? Yes. Well, they were attacking. Makes sense. So their targeting seemed to be fairly fairly swish. They blocked, blocked the attacks off, brought the bishop back. Wasn't really a fan of that, which I'm really comfortable with because now we can block the pawn from pushing down at least. Now we're looking to see if we can get the queen. Doesn't like that too much. And okay. Oh, it's a fan of the moves. It's a fan of the moves. That's not bad. Right, okay. Fairly happy with that then. Yeah, and they gave the rook up there. Nice one. 